Army Football 2015 spring practice continues. Rich DeMarco joined by Black Knights linebacker Jeremy Timp. And Jeremy, how is it going so far now and really past the halfway point of spring practice? How's this defense? How's this team feeling? Yeah, pretty good. I mean, we got a lot of players who've uh, played in the past few seasons, so I feel like our uh, defense has got a lot more uh, veteran. Offense has really been stepping up lately. We've got uh, some new players stepping into some positions, and they've uh, really shined there, and it's, uh, it's encouraging. Let's talk about this defense, and I think there's a lot of excitement around the defense, especially the guys coming back. This linebacking core is now a year more veteran. Where have you seen the improvement here the past couple of weeks? Uh, well, I think it's just been more crisp action. I think I think last year we would make like little mistakes, little fundamental mistakes, but this year uh, I think it's just our fundamentals and like cutting those little inches down that take away a yard or two to like a small gain really uh, really helps us out and. Uh, it just makes the offense not be able to like push three, three to four yards is a good, good drive for an offense, and uh, if we can shut that down to like one or two. I think that's our best bet. We've talked a lot about improvement from the off season and even through the beginning here of spring practice. Have a little over a week left. What things does this defense, this team, need to focus in on heading into that spring game? Uh, just getting our last, last feet together. I mean, we, we need to get more, a little more key, cohesive. Gosh, I'm a little, but. Uh, I think uh, our corners are stepping up pretty good, and uh, we have some new positions on the D-line. We have some injuries, so uh, just just a little more cohesiveness between all of us. That was Army linebacker Jeremy Timp, now joined by Black Knights quarterback Ahmad Bradshaw. Ahmad, for you here during spring, your assessment so far of your improvement and your performance? Um, I think I've gotten a lot better at leading the team and being more fundamentally sound and uh, reading defenses better, so it's, it's gotten a lot better. I know the difference is obvious, but just in your words, last spring, after a year of watching and then being on the field during spring, and then last year where you play the vast majority of the snaps heading into a spring, how much different has it been for you? Uh, it's a lot different. It's easier to just expect what my coach is going to call like before we go out there. and um, It's just easier to see what the defense is going to do because you kind of learn over, over the years. and It's just easier as a, as a player overall once you get that experience. Some veteran, at least in terms of snaps and games, at the quarterback position here. How has that got as a group, this unit of quarterbacks, learning and constantly improving and maybe pushing each other a little bit? Uh, it's gotten a lot better. A.J. Sure kind of brought this to me when uh, when I first came. He used to teach me a lot. So I kind of passed that down, like give my knowledge to Chris, and uh, Kaufman gives his knowledge to me, and we, we just pass it around a lot. So that's, that's helped us a lot. I asked Jeremy, I'll ask you, a little over a week left here of spring practice. What does this team, this offense, you need to do to get better heading into April 30th? Um, just work on executing uh, better. I know what to, what needs to get done as far as fundamentals and uh, reading the guy. Just got just to gotta do it. That's all. Just got to get it done. Well, Ma, thanks for a couple of minutes. Best of luck this spring. Thank you, sir. That's Army quarterback Ahmad Bradshaw. We were also joined by linebacker Jeremy Timp as Army football spring practice 2016 continues. Of course, the 2016 Army football spring game, April 30th at Mikey Stadium. For Night Vision, I'm Rich DeMarco.